comes your way next. Now to the plate, here is Eddie Rosario, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Well thrown sinker that time, down, but in the strike zone. And it's fouled away. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Oh, one and two. Grounded up the first baseline. He's got it. The tag, and he is out. Stepping up is Ozzy Albies as he'll dig into the left-handed batter's box. And this isn't his strong side, at least not in terms when you look at the stat sheet or his consistent contact rates. I just don't think he's quite as smooth with his rhythm and swing mechanics when he's hitting left-handed. Albies with a one-and-one one count now. Outside, two-and-one. Fouled off. And we're just getting started here in Minneapolis. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a 3-2 change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible to hit. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Digging in next, Freddie Freeman. The first baseman, number five, Freddie Freeman. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. Oh, that's cool. And we're just getting started here in Minneapolis. And he fouls this one off. Gordon's got it cleanly. So cleanly into first, and that ends the inning. That'll bring up Luis Arrives. It'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The third baseman. Now here it comes. Oh, yeah. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Hit to first. And this will get through into right, and he's aboard with a single. Runner at first following the error. And digging in is the outfielder, Byron Buxton. Buxton. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Ball one, no first fight. pitch fastball in on the fists for ball one. Morton has logged upwards of 1,400 innings pitched so far in his career. And sports an ERA right around the major league average at just over four. Hey, if he's going to execute that curveball, and that's the first one of the day, if he's going to execute it like that, be on the lookout for that one. That's going to be a big pitch for him today. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Popped him up. Darno over to his right. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. So a runner at first with one out now. And that will bring in Jorge Polanco to hit next. As a look, now the pitch. Snap throw from the catcher. Arias leads off first with one away. Pitch out. Nothing doing. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. One and this one's in the dirt. And he'll rein it in as the count moves to 1-2. and two. Fouled away. Runner at first here, one man out. And it's fouled away. Deal. 
And there he goes towards second down the third baseline. Ah, oh, way to get dirty. A oh, great stab, but this will be scored a base hit as the hitter reaches first without a play. So now to the plate, Mitch Garver. And he'll quickly send a line drive to center field. And that's in there, base hit. And the runner will score from second. Now he's safe at third as they take the lead with two runs scoring on the play. Josh Donaldson digging in now as he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. They've got two already home in the inning and a potential third waiting in the wings only 90 feet away. In prior outings against Charlie Morton, he's gone two for five. The 1-1 home is taken for ball two. He's not having his best outing in this one, and I think that curveball is part of the reason why. He couldn't get on top of that one, and that's not the first time that's happened. Unable to get the bat around in time, and the count evens at two and two. Bounces here, but a good job behind the plate to keep it at arm's length. And the runner's coming home. He squares, and it's in the air. And he makes the catch two away now. And he'll try to get back now, but it's not going to work. The throw hangs him out to dry, and that'll end the inning. Leading off the inning, it'll be Austin Riley. They'll look to spark the offense and even things up. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. As the sinker to him finds the zone for strike one. If he's able to dot that sinker down and away and execute that pitch all day, you're going to see a lot of weak contact, and the infield defense is going to be on its toes. Tries the slider to ring him up, but he lays off one and two. Polanco has a play, but it's the shortstop that gets there, and there's one away now. Up next, Jorge Soler. First pitch of the A.B. now. Reaches out, but he can't get it. It's nothing in one. What I love right there is just the freedom in that hack. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. Buxton is there, two gone. Base is empty, two away. And up next, former San Francisco minor league property, Adam Duvall. First pitch coming, here it is. Not even close on that swing. No balls and a strike. Hey, if you're able to blow a first pitch fastball by a guy, gotta believe that pitch is coming again right here. Fouled off. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. And right into the shift. But this will be a foul ball, and it's still 0-2. Into the windup and the pitch. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Last half of the second set to go. And up next is Alex Kirilov. I'm interested to see how focused their ABs will be playing with this lead. I think this needs to be a little bit of a smell blood inning. Keep the fire rolling. I know it's early, but keep the pressure going. Swinging the bat's nice. Late decision to swing that time, and as a result, it's 0-2. Hey, that's just a great mix of pitches right there, and that's what this guy's going to do if he's going to keep this team off balance. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. That is seven. Now one down with the bases empty, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Max Kepler. Off the plate and low here, ball one. Bases are empty, one man out. Now a swinging bunt. Kepler is a very well-regarded defensive outfielder. It used to be that fielders were evaluated mostly by the eyeball test and simple stats like fielding percentage, but of course these days, there are many more advanced ways that help determine a guy's work in the field, and in his case, he shines in many ways. You know, Matty, for me, I think he does pass the eyeball test. I know you have to look at all the numbers and the analytics to really appreciate a ball player like this, but man, does he come to work every day and play hard. 
first pitch on its way. Now a big fastball and he's well behind it with the swing. Hey, I got to really commend this pitcher right here. Was able to regroup. In a swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Here's the catcher, Travis Darno. 7 8 9, bottom of the order, the set to go here in the third. Rabbit. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hey. Slider gets the outside. That's a strike. The offense better get it going right here because they certainly can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. Swung on and missed. Really fooled in that time for the first out. The plate now is the designated hitter, Jock Peterson. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. And he fouls this one off. Gone! Dansby Swanson lining up to hit. So go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. The wind up and the 0 1. One out, nobody on. Got him. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Eddie Rosario. He bounced out last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. Shot weakly to the left. But it gets fouled. The 0 and 1 delivery. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. And a diving effort, but he can't make the play in right. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. And that'll bring in the former top prospect, Ozzy Albies. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. On 0-2 here, he doesn't have to give in with a great pitch to hit. He's got a base open, so he has to focus on making a good pitch right here. And what an effort on the running play to end the inning.